Hi, welcome to BMCC's Moodle. Right now you will see that we are on the dashboard. A couple of things that I want to cover is these buttons that are available on the dashboard. This button will allow you to see all the courses that we are offering. Um, we have online tutoring available. This button is for a screen reader if you need any text aid. This button right here will get you to our online bookstore so you can purchase your books for the semester. This will get you to your student records where you can check your grades, accept your financial aid. Um, this is a link to the student handbook where you can see policies. And this will bring you to Starfish where you can set up um, tutoring, advising times, and degree planner. So you'll also see a timeline section, and this section allows students to view any deadlines that they have in all of their courses. Um, you'll also see a section that's called Recently Accessed Courses. So after you start clicking through your courses, they'll show up here. Um, and then you have a course overview, and these will be all of the courses that you're enrolled in. Um, it's important to note that if the start date is not active yet in your courses, it would not show up right here. Um, there is a in progress future pass button, so you can search your course from there, um, or you can star it. So there are a couple of courses that you will be enrolled in as a student. Um, there will be a learner orientation course. So this will go over how to use Moodle, um, how to upload files, how to navigate, and there's also another orientation course that will be more on BMCC's policies, um, who to contact if you need help, and so forth. So after the course overview section, there is a calendar, and here is where you can view any important dates and events. Um, you can click throughout each month. You can even add um, a new event for yourself. So another thing to note is that we have this open block drawer. And when you click in there, you will see um, some student resources for tutoring, along with um, the hours, the days, and the subject. Um, here is for the read speaker, badges if you get any badges in any of your classes. Um, private files is where you can upload files and they will just stay there just for you. So online users, these are people who are also online. You can click to message them if you'd like. Um, and upcoming events, this goes off of the calendar. So you just go back up here to close the drawer. Um, so now you will see this little um, like bubble text button. This is messaging. So through Moodle, we have Moodle messaging, and this allows you to message other students, your teachers. So when I click it, it opens up a window, and here you can see all my messages with um, instructors, uh, students. So when I click on, on a message, you will see um, our string of messages. And if I'd like to write an answer back, I would just type in here. Um, there's emojis, and here's where you would click send. So here's where I will close my messages, um, and if I ever need my messages, they're all right here. Now if I want to send a message to someone, um, I can search them, and I can send them a message. And send. If you click on your name, you'll see that there's a couple options. Um, you can look at your profile to make some changes. Uh, the grades will show you all of your final grades or your current grade for your courses. Um, the calendar, again, for events, private files, your own files. Um, reports, preferences, and um, to log out. Um, anywhere you're on Moodle, you can always click the community college symbol and it will take you right back to the dashboard. And that's it. Have a great semester.